No, 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 no! Oh! Uh, Alberto Del Rio and Paige are suspended for the wellness policy. You know, the main thing that messes this up so badly is that, okay, Paige could actually do something and mean something for the women's division. She could. Because she did before. I mean, uh, what? It's, it's a sudden change because it's not the Divas Championship anymore? I mean, fuck. Damn. Then you have Alberto Del Rio. Now, a lot of people don't like Del Rio, but he's pretty solid in the fucking ring, and I can dig his matches. He, he can actually tell a story in a ring. He can actually get things done in a ring. He actually has fucking talent to be in a ring. So to see both of them gone for at least 30 days, it's like, fuck. Will this affect both of their careers? It probably will. They probably did this on purpose. Keep in mind, Del Rio and Paige are a real-life couple. Keep that in mind. Also, the draft split them up, which made no sense to me. And that is middle fingered all the way to the match. You're going to split up those two, and then you're not even going to do anything with them on their split. They're just split to just be split up on a fucking roster. So maybe, just maybe, they failed this wellness policy on purpose just because they can have 30 days together. Who knows? Maybe they know that their careers are not going to go anywhere because of the raw, because of the brand splits and, you know, the, the they're not getting any storylines or titles or anything like that. Who knows? Del Rio is basically in his, in his twilight years as far as wrestling, as far as I'm concerned. Paige, she's still at the fucking beginning stage of her fucking career. She can actually do something and mean something. So who knows? Who the fuck knows? Maybe Paige can be the one that comes back and actually tears it up to actually get the women's championship. Who knows? But it's kind of sad to see people with talent in the ring get suspended or let go or whatever, especially due to the wellness policy. It's like, damn, you know, that's just, like I say, they're a real life couple. Maybe they planned this. Maybe they did shit on purpose in order to get their suspensions. But in my opinion, it just sucks. It, it really fucking sucks. Um, yeah. What are your opinions about this? Do you actually care about these two? Do you think it was planned? Do you think it was just like, yeah, or are you just like, eh? They can go for about 30 days. It's not like they weren't doing shit anyway, which I do understand. But still, it just kind of sucks for these two to be suspended. You know, ugh. if they if they come back at all, what will be in store for them? Are they just going to be like, Ugh. or are they actually going to do something with these two since they're fucking separated on two separate rosters and actually hype them up to, for us to be to take them seriously again? Because Paige, we can take seriously. Alberto will need some work. We need to bring back Ricardo Rodriguez, you know, that, that entrance or whatever. But, damn it, I just, yeah, just had to get my quick thoughts about that because this fucking sucks. It just does. Drop kicks by Sam Strong, motherfuckers over top rope. Both feet hitting the floor. Yes, I'm a wrestling fan. This is the theme, and I'll see you later. Credits.